evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for coming. Now, let's imagine a scenario. When an accident happened, which one will probably get injured severely? You can take a guess and bear that in mind. Nowadays, we started living an eco-friendly lifestyle, just like decreasing carbon footprint and using power-saving lenses and recycling paper. Also, we do the same way in transportation. We ride bicycles and take cycling as our means of trans transportation. I believe many of you certainly do that, right? However, do you know what percentage of cyclists killed in 2010 reportedly were not wearing helmets? 70%. 70%. Even though there is a law which requires cyclists need to wear helmets. Moreover, according to the data in America, Hold up, it's, it's too big to show up. Now, here it is. From 1994 to 2010, the great part, which is a cyclist killed without helmet, is way more than the cyclist with helmet. Why? Why don't they want to wear helmet? Yes, as you can see, they just saw it looks stupid when wearing helmets. They also said that the helmets are bulky, uncomfortable, and hard to store. So, we started thinking about what if the helmet can be invisible and still protect our head. So, how could we make these heavy cyclist helmets invisible? Have you ever imagined that your helmet could be a beautiful scar? Or have you ever imagined that your helmet could be easily portable? Moreover, I believe that all of you feel hot when wearing a helmet during the summertime. You definitely want to install a fan into your helmet to breathe your head. Unfortunately, we used to look like this. Walky, stiff, sometimes even unhappy. Now, we can be look like this. Here, we offer you a solution for above questions. We can make your helmet stylish, make it portable, make it feel comfortable, and most of all, it is still protective. Ladies and gentlemen, Hofti, the invisible helmet. Why do we recommend this invisible helmet? Let's compare with the traditional one. First, the traditional helmet tra uh, occupies a lot of space. It is not easy to be put in your bag. However, the invisible helmets can just store in your bag like scar. Secondly, when we are buying a traditional helmet, we need to try different sizes. Sometimes it might be difficult to find the ideal one. The invisible helmet is just like a scar. Surround your neck. Will you choose your scar size? Of course not. Take Tony Stark, for example. In this picture, his head is too big to find a suitable one. <laughs> if he chooses an invisible helmet, he can surround his neck perfectly. <coughs> one of the most important reasons for many people who refuse to wear helmets is it's too uncomfortable to wear it. The heat feels in the helmet, and you just keep sweating. Also, Wear a helmet in a sibling day might block your hair follicle. We all know that this is not good for your hair. However, if you choose the invisible helmet, you don't need to put up with the sweat and feeling and the possible hair loss. <laughs> Another reason for many people who don't like to wear a helmet is it's ruin their hairstyle. Will you choose something to destroy your hairstyle? Of course not. The, invis the, invisible he the invisible helmet is just like a scar sitting on your shoulders. Uh, as you know, before we go out, we spend a lot of time on our hairstyle. However, 
our hairstyle ruined simultaneously. After, we put on the traditional helmet. <laughs> if you choose this, the, if you choose the uh, invisible helmet, you, you are still the charming person with the perfect hairstyle. Hopping has been cleared by European safety standard regulators. As you can see, if there is an accident, the hobby can cover more of the head, including your entire neck, than the traditional one. All right, according to the five comparisons above, I believe that all of you can't wait to see how to use it. You want to look as gorgeous as Tony Stark? Of course you want. Then it's time to say goodbye to this bulky Stark. And also the one who in your hairstyle. Before getting this, let me show you how to use it, how it works. In fact, every hobbitin has several sensors inside and around it. And each sensor can detect movement, vibration, 200 times per second. 200 times! It means you have no safety concern. No safety concern. Just enjoy cycling. Moreover, once the sensor been acti activated, it will trigger the gas inflator on the back of Hopti. Hold on a second, man. You mean there will be an inflator on my back? Literally, yes. But this is the smallest but effective one on the market. You can't even feel the weights when you wear it. Amazing, right? And what it will look like when you inflate it? Boom! Like this. It only takes you 0.1 second. 0.1 second to totally inflate it. Amazing. The technology we use is also the one we use in cars. Airbag system. Genius, right? And the system provides perfectly protection. Where it can also where it can protect nearly every part of our head and neck. And let's move on to a clip. This video will demonstrate how we test the airbag system. And this method we also apply on cars. High standard, high quality. Let's move on. Before you on, hold it on the ground, it pops up. Yes, it can ensure that before falling on the ground, your head has been already well protected. Pure genius. And after watching the slow motion one, let's move on to the real motion. Within one second. And this is how we redefine safety. Ladies, I know you can wait to get one, right? I can tell from your eyes. But just give me one more moment. Alright? Let me show you how to use it. It's pretty simple. Only three steps included. First, put it, uh, put it around your neck, like where it's gone. Second, zip it up. Third, attach the tag on the right side of the collar. Done. Three step, perfectly protect. Well, and before to the end, one more thing to mention. We do not produce Model T, so black is now our only color. The only color we have is variation. As you can see on the slide, we provide different kinds of pattern and style. You can just change it day by day just to suit any of your outfits on that day. Isn't that style, stylish easy? Yes, it is. And that's why we also call ourselves a safety designer. We don't want to be one of followers, but an inventor. We do not only provide safety, but design safety. Your desire, we are listening. We, we are, are hosting. I'm Leo. I'm Philip. I'm Naomi. Thanks, Thanks for, for coming. coming. Five minutes for Q and A. Actually, it's a good question. I know everyone wants to know how much is it. 
it costs three three hundred ninety nine euros. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I know, I know it's a bit pricey, but it's worthy. Let, let me give you some reasons. First, how the it's not only a helmet, but also can be an accessory, right? It can match your outfit. A second, according to the Swift, uh, Swedish insurance company, they do a test. Compare Hofding to, 20, uh, to 12, other 12 helmets. It's better than, it's three times better than other helmets. Third, we started to be mass production. So don't worry about the price. It will be lower. Do you have any questions? That one? It said waterproof. Can I use it under the rain? Yeah, it's waterproof. The shell outside is totally waterproof. And you can also, the, the fabric, you, you can also uh, wash it. Uh, now we only offer this product in Europe. If, uh, if you live in Sweden and Denmark, then you can go to the physical store. But if you live in, if you live in uh, Europe, you can shop on our website. I, I know many of you may be curious about this product and uh, buy in Taiwan. Um, recently, we noticed the green trend, uh, cycling green trend in Asia. So now we are trying to expand to expand to Asia market. I'm curious about if the airbag, um, if if ha accident happen and the airbag is full, can it recycle it usually? Actually, it just used once. It's a single use. I know maybe you will be curious about, but think about old bicycle helmets just come, just only can use once. Why? Because when you have a car accident, your traditional helmet is broke right. So I think it's the same. It's the same as Hofting. And let me add one more thing. After this is uh, export, you can just contact us and we will give you a discount for a new one. And also, you can contact your local insurance company. We are we have aligned, uh, uh, alliances with insurance company. It can uh, give, you, yeah, give you some compensation on it. So this one is only for uh, bicycle or bike. When I ride a scooter, the helmet can uh, protect my hands. Because you won't, in the video, you can only show uh, a a person ride bicycle. But, but I think in Taiwan, most of people ride scooter more than bicycle. Uh, yes, this this product is uh, designed for cyclists, especially in urban cycling, not the uh, extreme extreme sports like BMX. Yeah. BMX. And uh, we are now trying to expand in the helmets to another sports like uh, skyling, uh, skateboarding, or what? horse riding. Yeah, horse. even horse riding. Yeah. 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 Who's the wearing of helmets very hot, but if, if, if I will wear this, would it be hot? Uh, actually, uh, if you wear it in uh, loser feet or a tight feet, tight feet, it won't, it won't inf uh, influence the function. I think this product is very uh, convenient and stylish, but we wear helmets because of low, the low and the safety, right? So is there any proven evidence shows that it's safety enough? Evidence. Evidence. Uh, yep. As you can see the video, this is just one of our tests. But we process, we have processed the, the, this kind of test uh, th uh, thousand times. And it's also uh, passed the Euro safety regula regulation. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.